Hey there, crewmates. How's it going? It's Mift Crew here. We are in 2019. Woohoo! Happy New Year, crewmates. Uh, let's make it a great year this year here. And what I mainly want to discuss is what I'm thinking, my plans for 2019 here. We are going to start uh, with my plans for the animations. So, yeah, I'm definitely keeping up the Baby Foxy series here. Uh, especially considering that a lot of you crewmates seem to uh, particularly like this series here. So, I want to thank you so much for your support. And it's going to go on and strong. Um, also, on that note, I'd like to know what uh, you crewmates would like to share with this community, with you and Baby Foxy. Um... Because uh, a lot of you crewmates, uh, again, like I said, seem to be uh, particularly interested in the Baby Foxy series. So it'd be great to see what you would like to share with the community, with you and Baby Foxy. I just said that. I'm in an infinite loop. <laughs> and also, hmm, part four. Faff. Ring any bells? <laughs> um, also, quite a few crewmates. Crewmates? What's a crewmate? Crewmates are me, yes. Also, quite a few crewmates have been requesting uh, a fan-made version of Chapter 5. Uh, a lot more than I was expecting, actually. I wasn't uh, even sure if I should expect like any of you crewmates to be interested in uh, more bendy content yet. Uh, it has nearly 2 million views. I couldn't be more grateful for that. I don't really know what to say about it, really. Uh, just want to thank you so much, crewmates, for all your support on that one, too. Um, yep, I can, con I can definitely confirm that. Uh, chapter 5 fan made version will be uh, on its way. I actually started it uh, before chapter 5 came out just like I did with chapter 4 and chapter 3 and of course it's yeah it's not even near the finish but of course this channel really is all about you crewmates. I want to know uh, your thoughts um, on my plans going forward in 2019. Do you like them? Do you not like them? Are you somewhere in the middle? Uh, and whatever you are, please do comment your thoughts down in the comment section so I can uh, get a clearer understanding of where we are all at with these plans for 2019 so I can uh, go forward in the future in the right way, basically, because I want to make sure that you crewmates are happy. We also got be behind the scenes, BTS, uh, what else you call it, really, uh, tutorials, going to get on top of those more often here. Uh, Quite a few you crewmates out there seem to find my tutorials uh, quite uh, easy to follow and uh, very helpful. And I really want to uh, continue helping uh, as much crewmates as possible so that you too can be uh, can become a source filmmaker, animator of Fine Arts at Freddy's or Benny the Ink Machine or whatever you want to animate really. <laughs> and not to mention the off-camera secrets, I was thinking, you know what, it's all well and good having a uh, having an animation. But let's also see what... A, uh, what what else we can see in the animation? So let's uh, see some of the scenes from a different camera angle, perhaps. Let's see what's uh, let's see what a character is doing. Maybe we can't see him, perhaps. Maybe things like that. Really, I really want to uh, 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 share more of that with you. I think it can be um, uh, uh, quite fun and funny, really. And I was thinking also maybe like how I set up all my stuff. So. Maybe uh, maybe a little room tour perhaps, like what computer I use, webcam I use, uh, what microphone I use, which is um, this one right here. <laughs> it's a very good microphone, I can guarantee you that. Now some of you crewmates may be thinking, well yeah, it's uh, all well and good you wanting to do these things, but animations take a long time, how are you going to keep up the animations? To that I say, I'm always a bit up and down on how, uh, on how fast I can actually make animations. Like Over the years I have managed to gather methods of how... Uh, to animate quicker, but also keeping the same quality as well. I recently discovered that um, if the first thing you expose yourself to in the morning is a is a is an animation, or at least in my case that is, then um, I should be able to animate uh, uh, a lot quicker, but also still keeping the quality because my brain is more mentally prepared for it. Then this really is a subject for another video here, but uh, I think that's quite interesting. Uh, uh, that it can uh, possibly uh, work that way. It works for me at least. Uh, but again, it's really uh, this channel really is all about you crewmates. Do you like uh, these thoughts that I have for 2019? Uh, do you dislike them? Are uh, you somewhere in the middle? Please comment your thoughts so I can know where you crewmates are uh, with these ideas as well so I can uh, go forward into the future uh, uh, in a good way really. I really want uh, things to work out well. And we also have like other content as well so like the Mift Failed series. Let's say, for example, okay, so when I animate an animation, I always animate uh, with models, really. So I was like, you know what? Why not try making our own very, our very own Five Nights at Freddy's uh, animatronic model? So maybe like trying to recreate Freddy Fazbear and all that here. The thing is, I've tried it so much and I just can't get my head around it here. So I was thinking of a, uh, 
So I was thinking of uh, doing a myth fail series, not just on uh, modeling, but also other subjects as well, like making a Final Fantasy Freddy song or drawing a Final Fantasy Freddy's picture here. Uh, I was thinking you go for more of a comical approach, but also with a serious, also with a serious point as well. It's like, yeah, this is all very, uh, this is all very funny and frustrating, but. On the serious note, how do I break past this barrier so I can actually do an effective job of uh, trying to achieve these subjects here? So I was thinking the myths, I was thinking that the myth fail series could be good for that. Uh, not to mention uh, real life stories as well. I was thinking specifically college, a lot of crazy stuff happens there. So I was like, you know what? Why not share some of it with you, crewmates, as it's going along? Speaking of which, I also I, um, have a friend at college who's uh, quite good at drawing, and I remember I was uh, thinking of like starting. Uh, uh, this IRL story series with like drawings and stuff of uh, me, but like, I was thinking that uh, uh, My friend at college could be quite a good artist to like draw out the pictures for the video and stuff I remember I even mentioned it to my friend my uh, friend seems to uh, like that idea actually judging by the reaction So uh, again, this is all in very early stages here. They're all just in my head. Uh, we'll see how it turns out here um I really hope to achieve as much of these as possible in a perfect world all of these in uh, 2019. Uh, not to mention uh, maybe a situation series because uh, a lot of what goes on behind the scenes also depends on the situation I'm in. So maybe if I have a really tight deadline on a particular animation, uh, then I might uh, uh, then I might have to uh, temporarily drop some other subjects like tutorials and live streams and stuff like that. This is also why I've been uh, quite quiet lately until the new year because I've been working so hard with the Christmas deadline. <laughs> uh, so glad it got out though. It was uh, it turned out great at the end, and I'm so proud of it. I was also thinking of um, maybe doing some gaming content as well, or at least being more active on my gaming channel here. It's pretty quiet there at the moment. I'm hoping to boost that up. Uh, however, some uh, quite a few of the gaming content I do on my gaming channel does have mature content because some of the games I play are like Grand Theft Auto, Call of Duty, things like that. So. Uh, I might want to have a, an older person take a look at it first before uh, taking a look at it for yourself. Unless it's a family friendly game like uh, um, Minecraft perhaps then yeah. Otherwise I was thinking of maybe doing some gaming on my main channel. Uh, I was thinking what I could do here is that I could do community games like uh, Final Fantasy Freddy's gameplay, Benny and Ink Machine gameplay, uh, Benny and Ink Machine fan games, Final Fantasy Freddy's fan games, you name it really. Um, uh, and I was thinking what I could do also is that I have it all recorded so that anything that's uh, a bit too much for it to be family friendly uh, I was thinking I could either edit it out or I could uh, censor it out so we can still see the scene but it's all censored so uh, it should um, so it shouldn't really um, uh, be an issue when it comes to family friendly and all that here because this channel is a family friendly uh, channel and it's definitely going to stay that way <laughs> okay and I said it once I said it twice I'm gonna say it for the third time now this channel is all about you crewmates here, I just want to clarify that, so uh, like I said uh, two times already, there's anything uh, that um, you crewmates like, uh, dislike, or somewhere in the middle about uh, how this channel is going to uh, go forward, then please do comment in the comment section on this video here, so um, we can um, all be a, um, in the know on what you crewmates think, and so that I can also uh, go forward with this channel uh, effectively really, in a good way, so that uh, you crewmates are happy. I'm really hoping to get more me out there, uh, me being on the camera talking to you crewmates, and uh, yeah, see how it goes. Uh, that's pretty much all for now, crewmates. Thank you for watching. It's Miffed Crew here. I'll be back with more videos coming soon. Goodbye, crewmates.